Hey, what's happening everyone on YouTube? I hope you're having a fantastic day. I know I am. Uh, I've got a bunch of exciting plants. We're going to talk about one in particular. Uh, first, I want to thank a few new subscribers and uh, some people who have commented recently. I don't always see who subscribes. Sometimes randomly I get an email saying so-and-so subscribed. It's always random, but unless you actually comment or something or say, Hey, hi there, uh, I subscribed. I, I, I usually don't know, but um, I want to thank uh, Tattooed Alien, mystery subscriber. Been following for quite some time, has commented several times. Thank you so much. Uh, and uh, Kate Stinsing, thank you so much for following. I really appreciate it and subscribing. Uh, thank you. And um, can't leave out uh, Renee Boy. You've been there since the very beginning. I'll, I'll thank you, you know, forever. And uh, also... Uh, I, I forgot to mention someone a while back. They commented you know, once on one video, but uh, they definitely subscribed. Uh, 14 Fish, thank you so much for subscribing. Greatly appreciate it. Um, and then uh, Kelly Couch, thank you so much for subscribing and uh, commenting and asking questions and all of that. And then the most recent subscriber, I, I believe they subscribed. I live for tropical fish. Uh, this person's commented a couple times, peered out of nowhere. Um, and uh, thank you for, you know, asking questions. You know, the, the, the only dumb questions are questions that aren't asked. You know, I'm a stay-at-home dad, and my hobby, you know, when I'm not um, taking care of the children, is uh, all of the aquatic stuff that I've been doing. So... Now that I've thanked everybody, and uh, we're going to talk about a beast today. The, the, the beast of all, all aquatic plants. And I'm going to pull it out because I bought some, and I'm super stoked about it. So let's go get it. It's called Jungle Vallisneria. So let me get it. All right. I've had this acclimating in the tank for a couple days before I planted it, but I also wanted to show it to everyone. Now, this is the the mother beast of all aquarium plants. I mean, it, it's been popular in the hobby since the very beginning. I'm definitely not the first person to ever uh, talk about it, but, you know, rarely do you see videos where people are actually pulling the plant out and showing it to you. Um... It has other names also, and it can be found at your, you know, a lot of uh, typical local fish stores. You won't find it at big chain stores, so you won't find it at Petco or, or PetSmart. Uh, I have covered the majority of, of their um, plants, you know, and now I'm go getting outside of that. But uh, you can also order this too. Um, I didn't order this. I had a, a local guy here who, who has it, but... All right, like it's long already, but this is still a baby, okay? This is the mother of all plants. This plant can get up to six feet long, you know? And I got a, this is a 40-gallon tank, and it's not even halfway uh, to being an adult, and it's already, like, breached the surface and, and folding across the top, you know? So uh, I wouldn't put this in anything less than a 40-gallon, to be honest with you. This stuff is is massive. Uh, it, uh, some people call it tape grass. Also, it's also been known to be called water celery, but it is it is literally like a um, a freshwater seaweed, much thicker than your regular Vallisneria, and grows much longer. Uh, it's it's growth rate uh, super fast. Um, you know, it does go through an acclimation period just like a regular Vallisneria. So. You, you know, but like I said, I mean, when you get it, I mean, rarely are you going to find, like, babies of it. I mean, this is a baby. This is a baby. What are we looking at here? What? Like, two feet? It's got four more feet to go? It's just, it, it's beautiful, you know. Um, I'm super excited. I haven't uh, bought this before. Uh, it's new. 
And like I said, in this tank, what I wanted is uh, a lot of really tall plants. So, uh, you know, there's not really much to talk about this monstrous plant, except for the fact that it's it's huge. It's going to take up a lot of space. But what's really great about it is that, you know, it gives so much, you know, decor decoration and it takes up a lot of space and it gives your fish something to swim and weave in and out through. Um, but I am going to do a couple other videos. If there's any in particular that you would like to um, hear about first, just ask. I've also purchased um, what was it? Uh, a narrow leaf sword. I haven't um, started that one yet, so we can talk about that plant on a future video. I mean, we're going to do all of these, but if somebody decides they want to hear something about it first, just say something. So. I'll be doing a video on narrow leaf uh, sword, um, and then also dwarf Sagittaria uh, that I've got in there, and um, dwarf chain sword, and then um, also Christmas moss. So uh, if any of those pique your interest that you would like to hear about first, just say something in the comments, um, or just say hi, you know? Um, I, the whole reason I, I, I even made a channel is because I, wa I wanted people, I wanted to show people what I was going through in a beginner um, and things that worked and things that didn't work because I, I wanted to provide information and say, hey, I did this and I failed or I did this and it did great. And I, I show both because I'm trying to help new people, you know, who are, who are getting in and all of my instructions that I, I give are geared towards beginners and beginners who have uh, who only have access uh, to their local uh, pet stores like for me when I first started all I had was a pet smart petco and I started teaching myself with those plants you know and now I found a plant guy he's an hour and a half from me but he gets stuff that you'll never find at um, a pet smart or a pets co which is great and lots of shrimp too, so um, I, I go to him for 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 everything now. But um, you know, besides that, you know, say hey, drop a question. Um, if there's a plant that you want to know that I haven't covered, you know, because I haven't covered every plant um, that exists, I'd like to get to that point. Um, you know, so anyway, uh, thank you so much for watching. I greatly appreciate it, and uh, we will catch you next time again. Look at this gorgeous baby here. Yeah, can't wait to get that planted. And now I can that I've made a video of it. And I've got a few of these. So I'm going to get that going. And uh, thank you so much for watching. We'll catch you next time.